Hmm? Oh! Oh! Hey! Y you're the person that Uraka saved, right? Yeah. Sorry I didn't properly get to meet you earlier. I, uh... <laughs> I guess we were all kind of caught up in things, huh? Hmm? Oh! Uh... What am I doing up? Oh, I'm... I'm just keeping watch. We take turns throughout the night. I chose to go first tonight, so... Huh? What? You want to stay up with me? Uh, no, you don't have to do that. Uh... Are you sure? Well... It does get a little lonely, but... I've kind of understood that. <sighs> well... <sighs> okay. If... If you're sure. Hmm. Well... I understand. Yeah. I mean... <laughs> you're absolutely right. Hmm? I just, well... What is it? What is it? What is it? <sighs> okay, I, I guess you can stay up if you would like. Huh? Aww. <laughs> That's sweet. Oh, I see. No, that's fine. I'm just, you know, I'm fine. Oh, the sword? <laughs> yeah, it's from my mentor. Yeah, he's back at home, though, with my mom. Wait, well, it's complicated. Mm, no, I never really thought of it like that. I just... I always wanted to go on adventures. I wanted to be a hero. So naturally, I figured... The easiest way to do that was to go on an adventure. <laughs> you know, being... <sighs> being a hero is hard. Right. You're absolutely right, I understand that, but... The, I, I can't... Never mind. Hmm. You're right. Hmm. Hmm? I mean, you're absolutely right, but... Still, I need to, you know, be able to do my own thing, right? I know. I just never really thought about it like that. You know, I miss my mom. I miss my family. I just want to be myself. Hmm. Right. I see. I 
excuse me, what? Oh! Uh, uh, <laughs> well... The thing is... The way that this sword feels with me... And no one else can use it. I'm the only one that can. Uh, uh, well, it's special. Very special. Um... Uh, it's just a special sword. I, I can't really explain the details. I... <sighs> okay, okay. Fine. You can't tell Uraka and Ida about this, promise? You have to promise me, okay? It's... The sword chose me, okay? The sword chose me. Yeah, I know, I know. It sounds strange. But... In my village, there was this sword. This sword, right here. It was in the main... Stone, the main centerpiece of our town. I'd always seen it there. And then, I saw my mentor. His name is All Might. He went up there, and he had a sword similar to it. And he was bringing all the young people up, trying to see who could move the sword. Even just a little. I was the only one who could make it budge. He looked at me and said, the sword chose you. You were the next one. I didn't understand what he meant. But apparently, this sword, the one that he has, is the one from his generation. And the new one grows in place where the old one was. Apparently, it was in our town's history for so long. I wasn't born yet when the sword had fully grown, so I didn't even know. I know. It's kind of weird making it sound like swords grow on trees, but it's real. And after enough training, I was able to pull that sword out on my own. No. It's fine. I just... I really appreciate it. Hmm? Really? It, um, uh, I'm, I'm glad you think so. I know it's not gonna be easy, but I'm gonna do my best. This turned into a whole comforting session. <laughs> I didn't mean for it to. I didn't even let you get a ch really a chance to speak. You're okay with just listening? Aw, well, as long as you're sure. But you should probably get some sleep. It's almost midnight. The moon's almost high, see? Kira told me to wake him at midnight, so I guess I better do that before he yells at me for staying awake the whole night. <laughs> huh? Oh! Oh! I will. You just get some sleep, okay? Yeah. We'll regroup in the morning, all right? Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Mm Izuku. Izuku Midoriya. 
I like that name. I'm glad you like mine too. <laughs> well, good night. <laughs>